Uh, well, thank you both for uh, doing this. I have no idea <laughs> what is about to transpire. Yes, so there's two characters. Um, and uh, we need to decide who's going to play which character. So, um, uh, Rory, mm -hmm. I, am, uh, I am holding up uh either one or two fingers uh so you tell me whether it's even or odd and then if you're right you will be able to choose whether you're character one or character two okay uh even you're right oh, shit. yeah so congratulations rory yeah. uh which character would you prefer to read for I want Ben to have the pressure of being number one. Right. So I will read for number two. Oh, that is a ben. solid strategic choice. My rule is you can only speak your line one time. Mm -hmm. You don't get a do over. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, this is the last time I'm going to say this. Uh, I apologize <laughs> for what is about to happen, I think. Amazing. So you should now have the script sent in your messenger, in our messenger group. <laughs> like, I think I know what this says. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, okay, I'm getting it now. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Are you both ready to attempt this cold read challenge? Uh huh. Sure. Sorry. Yeah. I should have said. So this is a phone call between the two characters. Right. If you could quickly find something near you that you can appro you can use your hand if you want to approximate a, a phone to talk into. Mm -hmm. uh, but if you have an object that you could use that you can pretend is your phone, anything you want. Just so that you're talking into a I phone. Post-it yeah. notes. Oh, you have an actual phone. Fine. Yeah, I'm, I'm a professional. <laughs> yeah, so that looks really good. So, all right. So you're on a phone call. Uh, and let's try to take it away. Sup. Sup. Listen, you coming to the party or what? Gonna be gonna be a biggin. Park is turning forty. Gonna be a freaking wicked. Sweet. She gonna be a beer bash? Or oh, is Parker's old lady Elena put the kibosh on that? Last time I talked to uh, Elena, told me getting pa told me Parker's getting too old for any more keggers. That's bullsh. Elena should know better than anyone. You were never too old for a kegger. Got that right. Never too old for a kegger. You are preaching to the choir on that one. Elena don't know it. We it is we are keeping it on the down low. But there be a kegger too down at cellar. Mark my words, it'll be a full-on beer bash. So, you coming to what? Ah, uh, not sure. Might be stuck here in New York for a work the week of the party. Party's on a Saturday. Hop in the car and drive up Saturday morning, for Christ's sake. Frickin' car's on the frickin' fritz. Heater's gone, and I don't have the cash to get her fixed. You gotta have you here. Party won't be the same without you. Listen. I'll send you the dollars you need. Let's see if we can't get your boat, your cow fixed. How about? Nah, forget about the friggin' heater. I'll just suffer through the cold. It's not that far up to Boston. Can't miss Parker's 40th. Can't miss Parker's 40th. Listen, if you get too cold in the car, make sure you wear a Parker. When you get here to my apartment, you can store your Parker in a dresser drawer before we get to the party. Sounds good. I'll weigh uh, my purple Parker. Okay, I'll be there Saturday. Frickin' A. So, what you doing now? Gito ready? Nah, I was gonna grab a bite over at the Star Market a bit later. Maybe get a baked potato. Love the baked potatoes at the Star Market. Hey, on Saturday, you wanna bring me a cafe when I get there? I'll roll through the donkeys. Anna, Anna, and get you one. 
one cream, one sugar. Nah, I take it regular, one cream, two sugars. You got it. One cream, two sugars. Foa showa. Okay, see you on Saturday. See you on the Saturday. Take care. <laughs> I mean, you, the both of you nailed it. Obviously. I tried. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> How is that as an experience? I honestly, I think it worked better. I just kind of made the the decision myself that I wasn't gonna read them beforehand, and I was just like, like I wasn't gonna read them in yeah. between, and I was yeah. just gonna go for it. And I think that it got me out of my own head more than yeah. I was expecting. I have no idea if this is going to be entertaining to anybody. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't. It was entertaining for us, though. And like, yeah. that's, that's, a good that's all that matters, right? Yeah. I uh, enjoy this. Yeah, well, good. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> so I thought you both were uh, fantastic. Okay. <laughs> I guess that's it. All right. Uh, I won't hold you up anymore. Thank you so much for... Uh, being the first two victims, uh, guinea pigs for this cold read <laughs> challenge. Um, I, I can only say that stardom awaits. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah. Excellent. All yeah. right. Thanks uh, so much, Rob. Go along. Thanks. Yeah. Bye. Bye.